What's up guys, Eric here, and in today's video we're going to be talking about Supergirl Season 3 and I'm afraid I'm the bearer of bad news for people who were fans of Alex and Maggie of the Sandvers relationship because it looks like, like the worst possible scenario has happened and Floriana Lima is leaving the show completely. This means she's not like a guest character, she's not a recurring character, she's not a series regular, she's literally leaving the show. This was confirmed from Andrew Kreisberg in an interview with Entertainment Weekly. He says, though, that she always has the opportunity to come back, they're going to leave the door open. But this has got to be bad news for anybody that loves Sanders because these two characters, I mean, let's be honest, last season, they spent a lot of time building up Alex and Maggie as literally the secondary story throughout the most of season two. Um, so this has to sting a little bit for the writers and the creators that had big hopes for what was going to happen between these two characters. Um, but yeah, it looks to me like she's decided she doesn't want to just be like a once in a while character. She wants to pursue something bigger and better. I, I know that they said she was cast on another show. I've been digging a little bit. I know that there was, she was on a show called the family on ABC, but I don't think that's been renewed. Uh, Lethal Weapon was also a show that she was supposed to be a part of. I don't know what she's actually leaving for, but I know that she's parted ways with Supergirl. So again, this is just a huge blow to like, you know, fans of Sanvers and people that were championing uh, this relationship on Supergirl because it was such a big deal for so many fans of the show. So I'm certain that a lot of people are going to be mad about this. There's going to be people that are happy about it because I know a lot of uh, viewers, at least that watch my reviews, said they felt like this relationship took up way too much time in season two. So there's going to be some people that are happy about that. But this is a huge blow for people that were fans of Sanvers. Now, I know some of you guys out there are saying, but Eric, Andrew made it very clear that if Floriana ever wants to come back to play Maggie, the doors are always open. And that's great. I think that's great. And yes, that is a possibility. But thinking about this logically, what would be the purpose of her coming back to the show, which could be, you know, in five episodes or never again, what would be the purpose of her coming back to the show unless it was to be with Alex or to somehow close the door on that relationship? Like, I can't see any reason why they would keep Alex hanging on to this long distance relationship with a character who may never come back to the show. That's not fair to Alex as a character on the show. That's not fair to the viewers. I just don't see a purpose in her coming back again after closing this door with Alex, unless it's a one-off episode to sort of just, you know, uh, tie up any loose ends between the two of them. So that leaves us with one big question. Why do they break up in the first place? Why do they call off this relationship that seemed like it was working so well at the end of last season? Well, there's a few rumors floating around, but the one that I've been seeing the most, the one that seems the most credible is one of the two of them wants to start a family. They want to adopt a child and start a family, and the other one opposes that. And I believe it is uh, Alex that wants to start the family and Maggie doesn't. Uh, again, that's a gray area. This is all rumors. I just want to point this out. This is all a rumor, uh, but they want to start a family and the other one opposes that and it drives them apart because I guess, you know, they decide that they may not be made for each other. If one of them wants a family and the other one doesn't, uh, this is going to be a really tough subject to tackle on TV. And Andrew Kreisberg has gone on record saying that this is some of the most emotional stuff they've ever done on any of the shows. So what could be more emotional than, uh, the decision for one person in a relationship to want to start a family and the other person completely opposed to that. I mean, that's going to make for some heartbreaking television between the two of these characters, but that sounds to me like that is what is going to, what's going to happen between the two of them. And it's going to cause them to split up and one's going to go their own way. And the other will be Alex left on the show. Uh, so Maggie will leave. I mean, the thing is that, that bugs me the most about this is Maggie works for the police department in national city. So even if she's not with Alex, the police department is a big part of what happens on Supergirl, obviously, because of, you know, it's a superhero show. The police department in, all, in some way is always involved with these characters. Uh, so not having her there on the police department, uh, even as a once in a while character, is going to be really weird. So she's going to have to leave and go somewhere else completely. It's the only way it's going to make any sense. Yeah, so unfortunately, all signs are pointing towards Sanvers being over. It looks like this relationship is done. I just don't see how they could continue to, you know, nurture this relationship in the state that it's in with Floriana leaving the show. And this stings so much for the writers, for the fans, so many people that were invested in this relationship and these two characters and the story they were telling on television. And the worst part is I don't think there's any bad blood between Floriana and the showrunners. 
It's just a situation where she saw a career opportunity. It didn't align with Supergirl. And so she decided to move on. So, I mean, who are you, who can you be mad at in this situation? You know, can you be mad at the showrunners for trying to write a story that so many fans loved and enjoyed and, and giving it a chance? Are you mad at Floriana? Because as an individual actor, she decided that she wanted to move on and do something different, uh, something more promising for her, for, you know, not only her uh, roles in the future or, you know, money in her pocket. I mean, what what do we do here as fans? How, how do we handle the situation? Because this really is just one of those things where it just happened. There's really nothing, there wasn't anything negative in the background as far as I know. There isn't anything going on between, you know, the showrunners and her because they've left the door open for her to come back. But man, I mean, they, they built up to this big wedding and so many fans were excited about this. You know, again, I wasn't the biggest fan of side relationships in any of these shows, Sanders included. It's just not my thing. But I know a lot of people loved these two characters together and seeing them on screen and, and seeing what their showrunners were going to do with them. So I'm asking you guys, what do you think about this? Are you happy that Sanders is over? Is this a relationship that you were never about and that you're like, I, I'm glad it's over with this, you know, maybe Alex can move on to someone else. Or are you really upset about this? Is this news that you did not want to hear? Is this like worst case scenario for you? Um, or are you satisfied with the fact that the door is always open for her to come back? Because to me, that sounds like, yeah, we're going to leave the door open for her, but you know, we don't have any plans for her in the future, which is just terrible for all the work that they put into this relationship. Uh, it's just tough. I can't see Alex getting involved with anybody else because fans would revolt. <laughs> Honestly, if Alex tries to date anyone else on this series from here on out, if any of the Sanders fans stick around, they are going to revolt. Like the hardcore fans of this relationship are going to revolt. I can see it already. There's already a lot of backlash on Twitter and, and Reddit and we're not even talking about Tumblr, but there's just backlash everywhere about this. So I want to know your thoughts down below. Did you see this coming? Did you not see this coming? What are your general thoughts and ideas on this? Anyway, that's all I got for you guys today in this video. Take care and I will catch you guys later.